welcome to my channel. I'm Chloe. Please subscribe if you're new and give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. So today I was meant to be doing a lookbook sort of thing, taking photos from my blog and from here in the park, which is why I'm all dressed up autumnal. But then it started splashing with rain. <laughs> Got to love the British weather. So instead I decided to film an autumnal haul for you guys. Um, there's just basically loads and loads of random things in this haul that I've just kind of picked up over the past few weeks. Got clothes, pyjamas, makeup, <laughs> a bit of everything. I just thought I'd show you what I've been picking up. So let's jump right in and get started. So we should probably start with what I've got on right now. My entire outfit's from Primark. So we've got this lovely top with like a ruffle sleeve and there's loads of details around here as well it's really pretty um it is quite sheer and i've got a vest top on underneath this is a black vest top um it's really pretty all the colors are really autumnal and go with lots of things that i own because i love a bit of wine and burgundy <laughs> um so i picked up a burgundy corduroy skirt to go with it I'll show you properly when I try everything on, but yeah, I just thought I'd <laughs> start off with what I'm wearing. Um, I already feel this is going to be one of my go-to uh, outfits for autumn. It's really pretty. <laughs> First up, this blue suede skirt from Primark. It's got a zip up the back. As I already said, I will try everything on for you. Uh, but uh, this is really pretty. It's a little mini skirt. I actually picked this up to go with the top that I already had, which I'll show you one second. This top here, it is very pink but it's very autumnal as well. So yeah, I already had this, I think it's already been on my blog, uh, so you've probably <laughs> already seen it, but I thought with this skirt it will just look really pretty and the suede is much more autumnal so I think it will kind of make it all look a bit more wintry as seeing as lots of people think they can't wear baby pink in winter I, mean, I totally disagree but yeah with a suede skirt definitely much more wintry another skirt I picked up was this pink one it's um it said on the website that it was knitted, but it's not knitted, it's more like jersey kind of material and it's got elasticated waist. It's all very stretchy. Yeah, it's this firm Shein, which I hadn't really heard about until the bloggers started mentioning it, but it's actually a really good site. Um, it's, I think they're in China, I'm not sure. But yeah, they're really good quality, really nice. I like, I really like this skirt. I think this will look really cute with tights and Chelsea boots throughout the winter. Probably my favourite wintry purchase so far is this, oh, look at so much, gorgeous grey jumper, also from Shein. <sighs> See, so yeah, I always need to have a problem because she and lots of their things only come in one size and their jumpers are usually really big and I was like, I'm really small, I'm not going to fit any of these. And then I saw this and I was like, please, 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 please be small. So I looked on the size guide and it was, and it fits so perfectly and it's so lovely and it's got so many lovely details on all the way down the sleeve and oh, I've already worn it to death and it's going to be a staple piece for the entirety of winter, I think. So, first I was actually unsure about this, but I think after a little bit of altering, I think they should be okay. They're these wine-coloured, like, wide-leg trousers, but they're like... A little bit too short to be full length trousers, then definitely not culottes. So I'm thinking of kind of shortening them a little bit, making them into culottes. It won't be that hard to do, but they are very nice. They're like tie in at the waist. Oh, it's going to be 
screw it, but they're very tight at the waist and they're elasticated so they're going to be super comfortable and I think they were like £7 or something, ridiculously cheap and yeah, these are going to be lovely to just pair with like a jumper or a blouse and just kind of like effortlessly chic, I think that would be lovely. On to coats. Got this grey coat. I love this side of coat, that tailored look with the collar going down like most of it. I, I just think it looks really old fashioned and vintage and classy and it's lovely. I had a camel coloured one last year which has been on my blog which I will link a newer alternative for this year. And there's this beautiful grey one from Primark which is like 25 quid or something, ridiculously cheap for a coat, but it's so lovely and it's got pink trimming on the inside, which makes it amazing. <laughs> so yes, my winter coat for this year. You know me, I can't resist pink and I actually saw this coat quite a few times before I actually plucked up the coat to buy it but it's so beautiful, I love it, like actually love it. This is going to be my like going out coat, <laughs> yeah that'll be my casual coat, the grey one, this is going to be my going out coat. I think it's beautiful, oh, ah, I just love it so so much. Sticking with the theme of wrapping up warm <laughs> with the coats, I thought I'd show you what scarves and gloves I picked up while I was in Primark, which matched my coat. I don't know. Got this beautiful scarf, which is just like my colours, grey and pink. Beautiful. And that will go perfectly with my coat. And then to match that, got little gloves with the soap to the same colour as the scarf and then I was like okay gloves are like a pound <laughs> I think I can pick up a couple of pairs so I got some going out fancy gloves <laughs> for a quid yeah um which have little velvet bows on they're so cute I was like these are going to be perfect and they're a tiny bit too, too big because I have really tiny hands but how pretty they are! I love them, they're so cute! The pyjamas I'm about to show you are a dupe for some designer pyjamas but I can't for the life of me remember what the designer is called. I've tried to google it and I can't find it. I think it's Elizabeth something. I think. I can't remember. but. They're so beautiful. Just make sure they're looking right. There we go. With these silk, I'm just gonna focus. Silk like shirt style pajamas. So that's the top. And then the bottoms, which have a black edging on the bottom to match the shirt. They're so pretty and really classy, and they're just Think anything silky makes you feel a bit sexy, so that's always a good thing. They're just so pretty, and they're such a dupe for. If I can find the designer, I'll link like the actual ones down below, and I'm sure the price difference is going to be huge. Like these were like probably about a tenner, and the real ones are like hundreds and hundreds of pounds. So that is a massive saving. Big thumbs up for Primark. While I was out and about, I noticed that Victoria's Secret had a sale on their bras, the lace palm bras, and they're called, and they were fifteen pound. That's right, Victoria's Secret bra fifteen pound. I was like, gonna have me a bit of that, so got this 
gorgeous one. It's all lacy and open at the back. <laughs> I'm sure you know by now I love lingerie and I want to work on it when I'm older. I want to be designing it and stuff like that. So pretty lingerie like this gets me really happy. It's just it's so beautiful and the lace is so intricate. It's lovely and super comfortable as well. Because it's it's really, yes, really good quality. The last couple of things actually makeup products. So when I was out in town with my sister, we popped into Kiko, which I absolutely love. I've got lots of things from there before. Um, they're really cheap, but really, really good. They're like, I personally think the quality is a lot better than other high street makeup products, but they're the same kind of price range. In fact, they're probably cheaper than lots of them, but they're just so good. So. I used to use this mascara, then I ran out and I couldn't get to Kiko, so I didn't buy another bottle. But um, so when I saw this, and it was down to like 360 or something insanely cheap like that. So I picked up the extra extra sculpt waterproof mascara here, and it's got a really cool bottle or oh, package. It's not really a bottle. It's like really like. Geometric, it reminds me of a diamond, I really like it, and it's a really good mascara, really waterproof, it stays in your eyes for ages. And then they had their lip liners were down to 260. They must have had something to say in the sale on. Uh, so I got shade 503, which is this a lovely pink colour, but it's not too pink pink, so it's perfect for autumn. In fact, it all matches this top, I think. like a perfect match with the flowers on the top. <laughs> Woo. So that brings me to the end of my autumn haul. I'll of course link everything down below so you can shop it for yourself. So thank you for watching guys. If you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next one.